Welcome back to my entire Blu-ray collection once again. This is part five and the final part of my 3D Blu-rays. Um, this last bunch are DC and Marvel movies. And we'll start off with the DC because I only have four. Um, I'm still missing a couple. Uh, when I eventually come across them somewhere cheap with the slip covers I'll grab them but until then so I've got Man of Steel with the lenticular slip Batman vs Superman with a very poor lenticular slip uh, just picked this one up this week Justice League and Wonder Woman. So I still need Suicide Squad and I still need Aquaman. Um, Aquaman I, I haven't even seen yet. Um, these are literally, I think I've only seen each of these once as well. Maybe, I think maybe Wonder Woman twice. I'm not sure. Um, <clears throat> so when I get, when I see those others, I'll grab them. But for now, I don't have them. Uh, right, Marvel. So I'm going to go way back, well, not that far back, but uh, start off with the X-Men, uh, then Spider-Man, and then the MCU. So firstly, we've got the Wolverine, uh, Unleash Extended Edition, um, with the slip. X-Men Days of Future Past, and X-Men Apocalypse. The Amazing Spider-Man, The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Now, I got these all mixed up and I don't think they're in the correct order. But we're going to go with them as they are. So, Thor uh, wasn't originally made in 3D, I don't believe. Um, but it was reissued, same with Captain America as a 3D version. I've not watched the 3D versions of either of those two films yet, so I don't know how good the 3D is on them. And Captain America, the first Avenger. Also, I think these two were the only two, because they were reissues, never came with the original slip covers. All the others came with on an initial release. So I don't think you can get slip covers for those two. Uh, the rest of these, bar one, have slip covers. Um, so we've got Avengers Assemble with a nice shiny slip. I think all of these are. Uh, I've got a, a gimmick with the slip in some way being shiny, or I don't think there's any lenticulars. Um, Iron Man 3, Thor the Dark World. Captain America the Winter Soldier, uh, Captain America Civil War, Avengers Age of Ultron, Guardians of the Galaxy, Iron Man, um, probably my least favourite of the movies but one of my favourites as far as the slips are concerned. Uh, Doctor Strange, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, Spider-Man Homecoming, Black Panther, uh, Avengers Infinity War, I still haven't managed to find the slip for this one, but I'm still looking. Uh, Ant-Man and the Wasp and Captain Marvel um, this is the last one that I've got up to now I still haven't got a hold of Endgame although ironically I do have a slip for that one um, and uh, Far From Home Spider-Man Far From Home just came out so I don't own that one as yet and did my light just go off there weird 
Anyway. They're very short and sweet once again. So DC and Marvel. Um, and I guess uh, Ghost Rider could have probably been lumped in with this lot. But as that's already been shown in one of the previous videos. Ooh, uh, I don't need to show that again. Uh, yeah, so there we go. My entire Blu-ray or 3D Blu-ray collection, albeit uh, cut down into separate videos. Um, I think it probably works better this way. I might, at some point, um, edit all these five videos into one and upload them as a, as a single video as well. And maybe people prefer to watch it all in one go. Anyway, uh, we'll see about that. But, there we go. Thanks very much for watching. And I don't know what's coming next. Um, there's been a bit of a change in the cabinet to either side of me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Too much information there. So I might do a video on uh, on that. Um, but for now, uh, thanks very much for watching and I'll catch you whenever the next one arrives. Ta-ra.